If you're one of those people that always has your heating on full blast and your house is like a sauna, then you may want to turn it down just a little. Artificial heating makes the air in your home incredibly dry. This sucks out all the moisture from your skin and hair. With your skin being so dry, it's more prone to wrinkles. And we all know that wrinkles add years to your appearance. A study in Australia concluded that for every hour of TV you watch, your life expectancy reduces by 22 minutes. The study concluded that watching TV is just as much of a risk factor as obesity, because people who watch TV for six hours a day can expect to die five years earlier than people who don't. So technically, watching TV doesn't actually age you. It just takes years off your life. To combat this, the study suggests that we stand up every half hour and walk around, just to get our muscles moving and our blood flowing. I like sleeping on my side, but according to some experts, this squashes my face into the pillow which causes wrinkles on my cheeks and chin. Apparently sleeping on your back is much better for you, as it gives you a fresher face with reduced wrinkles. Sleeping on your front is believed to be the worst sleeping position ever. Not only is your face squashed, but it also flattens the natural curve of the spine which can lead to back pain. Some people see sun cream as something they only use when they go on holiday. I am actually guilty of this, but as I live in the UK, we don't actually have that many super sunny days. See, overexposure to UV rays is one of the biggest factors when it comes to premature aging of the skin. So if you want to stay as youthful as possible for as long as possible, start wearing sun cream more often and not only on holiday and not only on days where it's blisteringly hot. Adults need seven to eight hours of sleep every night. Not getting enough sleep not only makes you look pretty rough, but also reduces your life expectancy. Out of everything on this list, sleep deprivation is probably one of the worst things for your body. It can cause lack of energy, brain fog, weight gain, and also increases your risk of high blood pressure, heart disease, and in severe cases, even a stroke. You don't need me to tell you that smoking is bad for your health, and you may already know that it's also bad for your looks. Smoking can activate enzymes that break down the elasticity of your skin, which makes them wrinkle and makes you look older. Oh, and then there's the yellow teeth. I guess yellow teeth doesn't really age you, but they do make you look less attractive. So if you want to look as young as possible for as long as possible, ditch the cigarettes. I know, I know, it's easier said than done, but it's worth a shot. Have a quick think. Can you think of somebody who did something bad to you who you pretty much hate and can't forgive? Well, if you can, then experts say if you want to live longer and look better, then you should learn to forgive and forget. See, holding a grudge can cause stress and anxiety. Stress and anxiety can contribute to high blood pressure and depression. If you can learn to forgive and forget, you'll be much happier. You'll feel better physically and mentally, and you'll just be an all-round better person. Life's too short to hold a grudge. Believe it or not, some low-fat diets can actually contribute to you getting wrinkles and looking older. See, our body needs omega-3 fatty acids to help keep our skin super smooth and supple. And denying our body of these acids will cause premature aging of the skin. Okay, I know it won't actually affect it that much, but it does contribute ever so slightly, and every little small factor adds up. And that brings this list to an end. If you enjoyed the video, then it would be much appreciated if you give it a thumbs up and shared it. If you're new around here, then why not subscribe for new videos just like this every week? Anyways, I jolly well hope you liked it, and as always, thanks for watching.